Hello everyone, it's Perenko from Team Forest and this video is about managing the footer on the Pulse theme. So from your dashboard click on theme options and select footer. And um, before we, we look onto these options let me tell you that uh, with, uh, with this theme you don't uh, have to, to have the footer active just to, to show uh, what, what we can call a, a, a footer. Okay, For instance on this page the agency um, if you scroll down, you will see this uh, this Instagram element and this, which we can call a footer, but this is all built in the page with, with Visual Composer. So if you are using a single page website, maybe it's enough that you create the footer just using a Visual Composer, okay? If you have multiple pages and you, you want to repeat the same footer on all pages, then you should uh, you should use this option here. On the footer section and turn the display footer option on okay which is for instance what i have here on the main demo we have this footer that's that's uh, repeated uh, this image and this footer that's repeated on all pages so in this case I, I recommend you to to use this footer section so that you don't have to to be recreating the same footer on all pages so back here to the footer section so you can turn in as i was saying on or off you can also make the footer position fixed which will create kind of a reveal, reveal effect if you have it if you turn this option on you can set up the footer font size the footer colors the footer top border color background color you can also use a background image or a pattern so you have total flexibility in terms of the footer and um, you can also add a, spa a special page before or after the footer widgets. Okay, so if you look carefully onto this um, this main demo, this here is uh, uh, actually a page content that I created specifically to be displayed before the footer. So I have here the widgets of the footer and I selected the option to add a special page before the footer widgets. So if you turn this on, you will, you can select any page that you create here, uh, sorry, that you create on, on WordPress. So this is how we, we create kind of this, um, this extra footer or extra footer area, okay? We can append a, a page before or after the, the footer widgets, which, which are these, okay? And uh, by the way, you can turn on or off these, these widgets here and they are, they are managed under appearance widgets. We have your specific sidebar for the footer. Here is the footer sidebar. And um, back here to our options, you can also set up how many widgets you want to see on each row. In this uh, case that I'm, that I'm Showing here we have four and you can also add some extra text that will be displayed after the widgets which is this uh, text here on the left and this text on the right. You can also put that text here on the left and on the right. Uh, once again these, these options are, are not connected with the page that I'm showing but um, it's just to show you where, where things are done. Okay. And the final option, obviously, is the after footer, this, this text, the background color for this, this whole area. Uh, in terms of footer, that's all for now. Thank you very much for watching.